Matt Chinian here. Prosaic realism is something I kind of made up. I thought about it quite a while, and it seems to fit what I do. Prosaic essentially is a commonplace, it's utilitarian, it's mundane, it's something you would pass by. You would not necessarily be sentimental about it, or you might not necessarily be ro romantic about it. It's, it's not something you, um, you put that kind of poetic quality into. And in landscape and in realism, you're, you're, you're painting what you see, um, painting as you see it, and you're recording something. It's, it's kind of always a little bit prosaic because you're, that's the utility of what you're doing. You're depicting something else. <clears throat> and um, that's um, the other part of uh, prosaic realism in terms of painting it in a direct and straightforward manner. There's not a lot of flourish. There's not a lot of fancy stuff going on. Not a lot of stylization. You go straight forward to depicting something that is in front of you without a lot of um, change. As the, at least that you think you're not changing it. You are, of course, because you can't help it. You are you. We are you. I mean, I look at things. Drain the color out of everything because that's the way I see it. That's the way I like it. And, but it's an automatic thing. It's not like I'm actually thinking about that. It's just happening as I try to depict places and things that are in front of me on a daily basis. Like, where am I? What am I doing? And that I find what interests me because that's where I am. And I, I'm not looking to go to the mountaintop at this point. And um, I want to see what's here. I want to, I want to tell you about my life here and not about something that's not something I'm not. So that's a lot about what, what goes into finding a subject. Um, and as well, understanding that the painting isn't necessarily about that place. It might be about the relationships of shapes and patterns, colors, values, textures, all of those things that go into a painting. They're really abstract qualities. And, um, and in some ways that, that's antithetical to what, what, what pro prosaic realism means because all of a sudden you have a sentimental tie to something. And um, I think tensions are great. I think it's like setting up, setting up a dynamic where, where those two things can, can have a dialogue and understanding. It's like how we live in ourselves. We have an understanding, we have a dialogue, and, and we have, um, we have conflicts and you try to resolve them. And that's what a painting tries to do. You may not completely, but you may get a little closer and that's a good day. Thank you.